in we, Los we just Angeles. Got trying word to that Anita again. Vogel is, Anita uh, is, is available now okay, in good. Los Angeles. Uh, Anita, we'll, we'll come to you with this. Uh, did you feel it at all? We felt it a little bit here, Leland. It shook very softly for about 10 seconds. Now, keep in mind, our Fox Bureau is in West Los Angeles. We're about two and a half hours away from that epicenter in San Bernardino County in the Searless Valley. Um, it's, you know, it's kind of in the middle of nowhere, uh, to be honest with you. Um, it's in San Bernardino County, again, the Searless Valley. It's kind of halfway between Bakersfield and Los Angeles. Now, it is a six Point four magnitude 6.4 that's a fairly large earthquake but of course being two and a half hours away we wouldn't really feel the brunt of that here now okay. we are monitoring uh, the wires to see if there's any reports of damage or any injuries so far we haven't heard of anything All right, uh, we just got this in from the Los Angeles Fire Department in Neagle, Anita. Uh, all 106 fire stations are out conducting a strategic survey of their districts to determine if any damage exists once the process is complete and overall of assessment and impact to the city will be made. And this is an important note for people who are watching out in California. Uh, this from not only the Los Angeles Fire Department, but the Los Angeles Police Department as well after this earthquake. Please do not call 911 unless there are injuries or dangerous conditions to report. And then they come up with this. Residents are reminded of the potential of aftershocks to drop cover and hold on. And they say there's going to be an additional alert issued once earthquake mode is complete. Anita, as you guys have made your initial and cursory phone calls around, uh, any damage reports, anything from LAPD or Los Angeles Fire? Yeah, the good news is, Leland, we're not hearing anything at this point. Um, again, I want to stress that Los Angeles is quite a bit away from the epicenter of this earthquake. Uh, the, the cities that are going to be feeling the brunt of this are cities closer to the Searless Valley. We're talking about uh, Bakersfield, Lancaster, uh, the Big Bear, California area, Lake Arrowhead. Uh, those areas probably got a pretty good shake, and they're there could possibly be uh, some minor damage in those areas. Here in Los Angeles, um, most people probably didn't even feel it. Hmm. Um, but we're still calling around, making our calls, uh, just to make sure that uh, we're not missing anything. And, of course, we'll get back to you as soon as we find out. Yeah, it, Anita, thanks so much. We'll let you get back to work making some calls and seeing mm -hmm. if there is any damage reports north and west of Los Angeles. This earthquake was about 150 miles north and west of Los Angeles in the Mojave Desert, quite literally in the middle of the desert. Uh, the nearest town that we can see on the maps here uh, that we're working on is Lancaster and Bakersfield that is about an hour and a half away from the epicenter. Yeah, and San Diego is about an hour and a half drive uh, from Los Angeles, and I've got some friends there. Mm -hmm. uh, I used to live in San Diego and work there at the Fox station, and they're telling me that they, uh, she says, uh, texted me saying it was a, a good shaker here in San Diego. In fact, yeah. if we can, I'm trying to get them on the line to kind of give us an idea of what they felt. Uh, we're working on that right now. But, um, you know, in situations like this, again, it's, it's one thing when you've got uh, folks uh, at work and on the freeways, et cetera. Uh, in this case, folks are probably on the freeway on their way to those areas. Like I right. said, this when it's uh, 11 o'clock in the morning there right now in uh, Los Angeles, just about the time that you get geared up to go to these uh, cookouts. Well, noteworthy your people aren't in a place they're used to. They're not used to the evacuation plans at a hotel or somewhere else versus being in their offices or their houses uh, when this would have struck. So we're going to continue to work the phones and uh, monitor this. Uh, out in California, as you point out, 11 a.m., uh, this earthquake report happened would have been about 1035 or so uh, local time for that six point four quake.